Victoria Beacon Hill. Madam Speaker, I'd like to remind the Minister that the RCMP are doing everything they can. This is not within their mandate. They need the leadership from the provincial yeah. government to give comfort to these families. <laughs> Madam Speaker, the family of Sid Neville had to reach out to the United States to the generosity of a couple down there to come up and search for their loved one. The community of Burns Lake has reached out and assisted with the search. They've held bottle drives and they've had garage sales. That's what they've been doing to assist the family, Madam Speaker. Two agencies that this government already works with, the RCMP and BC Hydro have the expertise and the equipment. Again, to the minister, why won't the minister show leadership that is needed and work to assist these families with the closure that they need and deserve? Minister of Justice. Madam Speaker, I agree with the member opposite. The families do need closure, and they do wish to have recovery of their loved ones. That is why the police go out day after day. They go back again to these locations because they, too, want to recover these missing loved ones. And I don't think that there should be anything in this House which sheds doubt on that. They are working hard to find these missing people. Some they, are, they have found some, there are some they are still looking for. They are working hard to make it happen. I am not going to go out and tell them what equipment to put where, but I think we should all rest assured, Madam Speaker, they are doing everything they can to bring resolution to these tragic cases of British Columbia.